Welcome, welcome to the Smoke Fan. Today we're eating a garlic chicken. Very tasty. With um, spicy peppers, potatoes, and mushrooms. If Jack can order a Matthews on the stream. I can eat my meal on stream as well. Beautiful! Oh, that's gorgeous, that. The peppers are seasoned to perfection. So, yeah, we're going to sack Life is Strange off today. Instead, we're just going to watch me eat. I hope that's okay. Hello, Slushy. I hope you're cool with that plan. I hope you've been alright today. What am I eating? Oh, well, Sonia, I have for you today uh, garlic chicken with potato peppers and lettuce. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. beautiful. So I say, Jack, you can order a mac so I can eat my, my, my dinner on stream since we're taking liberties. How are you doing, anyway? In all honesty, Craig was like getting me dinner. Oh, very delicious. Oh, I didn't know that. Chloe's outfit is what you're currently wearing in the game. That's a cool little detail I had no idea about. Oh, fuck. I was actually going to cosplay as Chloe. Well, I fucked that one, haven't I? Oh, my jacket's downstairs. Mmm. Oh, beautiful. Don't worry, guys. We'll, we'll get going in a minute. I just, uh, you know, I, I said half six. I was like, well, you guys can watch me eat and we can hang out for a little bit first. Oh, perfection. Don't worry, we're nearly there, guys. What I love about Before the Storm is that it's seasoned to perfection. The blend of acidity with the sweetness comes together in this beautiful kind of like, you know, really elegant harmony, you know? And all the ingredients of it come together to make this absolute brilliant mouthful. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry, that was the meal. Before the Storm's an alright game now, isn't it? If I was to like then the arm now eating, you always surprise us. Yeah, well, you know, this channel's about variety. Um, you know, you got to be different, haven't you? Like, to be honest, I say that. I'm just, it's myself, really. You know, I'm not one to really follow the rules. Yeah, I'm good. I'm um, a little tired. Busy day at work today. But we're doing well. I'm happy it's the weekend. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm going to have a taste bud of gas in a minute. So uh, you're writing a book, aren't you? Um, any, uh, you'll have to tell me a little bit about what it's going to be about. I was telling Jack today that last night I had a really vivid dream and I just dreamt up like a whole horror game. Like I literally tried a horror game in my brain. It was pretty interesting. One particular level had like Weeping Angel vibes from Doctor Who. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Right. Maybe there, guys, are my female friends away, I promise. Oh. Arms and neck, and now it's the inside of his mouth. Don't see him. Oh, you haven't seen anything yet. 
wait till I start rubbing this nostril around my left nipple. No, I'm kidding. I mean, that's not gonna happen, guys. Hello, Tatjana. Oh, you chose a great time to enter. Right, if I shut that phrase. Good to see you. I hope you've been okay. Yeah, so we're doing a we're sucking life for strange off and we're doing a mukbang today. I hope that's alright with you. Mm-hmm. Oh, stunning. That's bad guys. And voila. Wiped it clean. Right. I'm chewing really loud in front of the microphone as well. That's probably not a good look. Oh well. Okay, so let me just have a swig of water and then we shall commence. Thought I'd leave some music on for you guys before we start. Ah. Yes I do, Sonia, yes I do. Oh, it's boiling in this room now, I might have to strip, guys. Oh, it's all, it's all heating up. Oh. Beautiful. We won't, we won't be needing that. Right. Why am I here? Oh, what are we doing? Oh yeah, we're gaming, yeah, that's the one. Oh, my headphones are cool in my chair. There we go. Oh, can everyone hear me okay? Is the volume good? Oh, beautiful. Space to leave. And the forest is still uh, burning. We be burning. Oh yeah, you asked about my book. It's an animal fantasy. The main character is a wolf and the theme is self-discovery. Oh, okay, interesting. When it comes out, I'm reading that. Volume of the game is loud, but I assume it's because of the mode. Yeah, okay, yeah, hopefully it's better now. The book also involves cats. Well, uh, <laughs> you had me at the first part, now I'm definitely watching it. Let's continue. Guys, we have a play to rehearse. I remember we're doing The Tempest in a minute, aren't we? Let's go. Right. I've got chicken in my teeth. Didn't think I'd be back this soon. Talk to stuff. Oh yeah, we about oh. to kick off with some D and D it today, guys. Nice. Wet concrete, I'm totally gonna try and better hurry up and get into the dorms. What does Rachel want? Back at school yet again, they've got some tents up for dressing rooms. What are you up to? I'm here too actually running an errand from Oh yeah, we read this last time, didn't we? We we can forget about it. Alright. What would I buy if I had enough money to build a whole dorm? Probably not a dorm. I should come hang around here during finals. Make everybody jealous. Sounds like a very Chloe thing to do. Can we step on the wet concrete? Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. Oh, and it made, does that imprint? Was that us that did that? No, it wasn't us. It just was like that already. Oh, we can graffiti. <laughs> a new medium. See, oh, uh, hey, Mirrod, how you did? See, I really like the jacket. It got mixed reviews last time. I'm a fan. I've got the same one, kind of, without the stripe, but I've got a purple and yellow uh, varsity jacket. Which I was sporting in the first Royal Rumble. Right, guys, what are we doing? Abandon all hope or Tempest Tossed. Uh, I'll let you pick. First to two votes wins. Oh, you had a week off. Nice. Abandon all hope is 1-0 up. 
Abandon all hope is 2-0 up. We're going abandoned all hope. Have you guys ever ruined, like, concrete Welcome before? And, like, wrote in it? I wish they thought that they were going to make this game before, because it would be cool if uh, Clevis Graffiti carried on into the game, or if it carried over somehow. Like, that would be cool. I always knew that one day Miss Price would leave an indelible mark upon this school. Just... Ugh. Yeah, we don't. We won't be needing that. Oh, the totem's back. I love that. Oh, Evan being all fancy smancy. Can we turn mm. the sprinkler on? Like the way we. Oh, I think we might be able to. Yeah. Evan's subject for the day. Better you than Let's me. Let's block bird. him. Do you want to take some photos of my feet? We did it in the first stream. It was beautiful. Blackwell Academy. Conserving water since never there's Evan. Oh and yeah, we probably pissed him off by like graffitiing his survey last time, didn't we? In a way, uh. that's kind of badass. Look at that texture issue. His foot is like sunk into the ground there. What are you doing here, smoke weed de bear? You're not still upset about that, are you? Aren't you supposed to be at home thinking over your endless list of questionable decisions? Dude, why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me when intelligence is wasted. <laughs> Did Evan just call me intelligent? Damn straight. Wow. Evan looks... Really ridiculous. Uh, I'm gonna say nothing. I'm not feeling Chloe. mean today. Uh huh. I've learned something about myself recently. Something that I think you might understand. I've learned that if I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. Forest fires, for example. You should have taken my petition seriously. <laughs> like anyone else did. Did you really expect people to care? People are so eager to pass on responsibility to anyone else so that they can live comfortable, unworried, and ultimately meaningless lives. You see what happened? <laughs> Looks like you were right. <laughs> Go, Evan. You're a hero of the people. I know you feel like I do. Can he die? No, no, I saved him because sure. you rewind time in episode you 5 when the storm happens. About what you give a shit about. I like that. I anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave. No, well, you know, you can all vent if you want. I can try and give my lean perspective. I can't promise it'll be great, but I can try. Oh, no, I forgot he was in this game. Oh, Hi there, Max. My spirit animal's a squirrel. Huh. <laughs> That's some intellectual shit, Samuel. Go, oh, uh, okay. Nice work, Samuel. Okay, I didn't know he was into woodwork. Such a nice white door. <laughs> okay, yeah. so we've got it to distract him like to graffiti. Yeah. Does it? Hey, Samuel. Keeping busy? Always, Chloe Price. I didn't think you'd be returning to these hallowed halls so soon. <laughs> it sounds different. I. I have the feeling it wasn't uh, the books or bricks of Blackwell that led you back. Oh, I don't <laughs> like it. What? You're here for someone. A special someone, yes? Well, I'm going to say Rachel. I'm not going to tell him, Drew. What do you think of... Rachel Amber. Oh, okay. We can pick my Rachel up. Amber is a dragon made of diamonds. Oh, that's uh deep. <laughs> do you just make this shit up on the fly, or do you like write it down beforehand? Are you angry all the time because you like the way it feels? Yeah, I get. I, I'm really with you on that one, touch on it. Defense against experiencing true intimacy with others. Like, it's not that it, 
it's a combo of the fact that it's different, very different, but also it doesn't sound good. I'm. Uh, it sounds like he's reading it off a Drew sheet. North. You know what I mean? Just look at Drew North and see only the athlete, but he is more than that. He is. A great heart he has, with much love and no room for fear. <sighs> I've always thought he was kind of a bully. He may be that, too. No one is just one thing. Okay, I'll, so, I'll ask about Elliot. Uh, what about Elliot Hampton? Have you seen him recently? I only see what Elliot wants me to see. His cock. Okay. Usually I can see both what people want me to see and what they want to keep hidden what do i want people to see what do i want people to keep hidden hmm i'm intrigued by hidden and uh what what do i want to keep hidden that you are lonely and afraid um It's okay not to be okay, Chloe Price. I've got to go, man. Uh, it's been real. I often wonder what real is. Farewell, Chloe Price. Right. Um, we're going to hit calling out, saying I'm lonely. I've got plenty of people. I hang out with uh, w my mum. My dog, um, the the guy out on the street who who nods sometimes. Position. Um, it's okay. It's okay. Um, it's okay to not be okay. I mean, he's not wrong. It is okay, right? Um, tell you what, I kind of want to try this graffiti thing before we speak to uh, uh Steph Gringrich because clearly we can graffiti, right? I just guess we can't do it while he's here. So we need to. Do we want to though? We just like clearly sh she can almost graffiti here, right? Such a nice. But episode two, head with a view, Illuminati. Oh wait, no, I'm halfway through. So I I've missed that one. Message board, closet door. Is it that one? Um. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, you can, but it's later. Okay, cheers for letting me know. Right, well, let's... Who wants to play some D&D? &D? I always remember the first bit. I actually don't know if I've done this. I mean, I probably have, but I just I don't remember what goes on. Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Calamastia. Surprised to see me on parole? I told you Wells was out to get you. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other On top of the shit. Oh, we could have got there. Thanks for trying, but skipping yesterday was totally worth it. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So, what are you doing here? Oh, in the next episode, cool. Uh, seeing... The, uh, I'll be true. I'm just picking up something from uh, somebody. It's for a friend. Now I'm really curious. What are you doing? What's all this stuff? I'm prepping for the Tempest show tonight. I'm the stage manager. Oh, right. Uh, I think I knew that. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. I am worried about Victoria coming in now and trying to hog every scene. But the cast overall is fantastic. You get to see a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Well, I'm going to be in it, so I might okay. as well say, yeah. I'm intrigued. Go on. And Elliot's going to be like, so you said annoying, you were busy. But when he puts on that crown, he's actually very princely. And Nathan is Caliban. There's so much depth there. Right. Nah, tell me what, what it said, Tatjana, if you may. Yeah. Well, good luck with all of that. 
Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. Make a move? So, are you? Uh... I mean, that's Rachel's business. Or maybe yours and Rachel's business. But if you feel comfortable telling me... I'm gonna let you guys vote, because I generally don't know, and I feel like it could be important. Tell her she is single. The thing is, though, if we get with Rachel, is that gonna piss her off if we, uh... Toxic work environment. Damn, is that recent, Tatiana? Because maybe Jack and I should, uh, shed a light on that. What is it with all the uh, the games developers lately? Like, there, there's layoffs, toxic work environments. There's so much stuff happening. Oh, wow. Nazi symbol. Okay, well, I might have to make a video on that. That is very recent. Um, tell you what. Guys, this is... You're about to see some live uh, Butterfly Effect podcast work in here. Hey, Jack. Uh, you're on the stream right now. I'm currently in the stream with the likes of Meridarim, Tatjana, Slashin, Sonia. Uh, and Tatjana has kindly shared that uh, there's this, which might be worth having a look at. And I'll send him the screenshot. And now Jack is going to go ahead and do research because... We're efficient. Oh, and Billy's here. Sup, my guy? Okay, sorry, I I've uh, completely neglected. You think, uh, tell her she's single, she's single. Okay, well, it looks like that's winning, so we're going for that one. She's single. You sure? That's what I said. I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. Oh, it's the drama that happens. Well, fuck it. If you want a chaotic playthrough, we can do that, you know? Locked. Let's go to the dorms. Oh, okay, so... Looks like my options are become a master lockpicker or swipe someone's keys. Okay, well, I think I know how to do I am back. My brother decided to talk to me. Bingo. If only those keys were unsupervised. What's Samuel working on? Uh, the sprinklers? Well, let's fuck the sprinklers up, then. Okay, so we need Evan to clear, so we're probably gonna have to tell him some shit. You shouldn't be on campus, Chloe. Oh, fuck you. Did we just... If Samuel's working on the sprinklers, some damage here might get his attention. But Evan is right there. Okay, so we scare the bird away. Yeah. Yeah, where is Felicity? Tatjana wants hey. to kiss Rachel later. Well, we'll see. Well, it depends what wins I the vote. I you to go the other way. Like, as far as possible, the other way. Was I on the phone to someone earlier? Uh, oh, did you just catch me? Yeah, Jack. Uh, Tatjana raised uh, something. And uh, I thought it would be uh, a good video, so I thought I'd get Jack to... Uh... Oh, and it just... Time for a fresh start. Okay, so I've got to plan this. So, scare to there. Gotta scare it the other way. Oh, and do I have to like push it towards? So we've got seeds, seeds, seeds. This is like the furthest point where there's seeds, though, isn't it? Is there anything in the bin I can kind of? Maybe to that one there, then. I don't know. Oh, it's just gone back there. Uh, I'll be... <laughs> slashing. Yeah, good. Someone's got to do it. Scare her towards him. Oh, thank you, Irene. Good to see you. And I'll do just that, then. Let's see if that works. 
Here we go. Okay, so his back's turned. Don't, can I smash it in front so of him? So tempting, but Evan will see mm. me for sure. Oh, and, and then... he sounds like he's in the mood to get me in trouble. I think. Okay, well that worked that way. If I if I scare it this way, will it like leave? Okay, so it goes there. One small flight for this bird, one giant leap backward for Chloe Price. Okay, so not that way. Thing is, like, I don't know, are there seeds anywhere else over this way? I don't think there is. If I can scare that bird far enough away. So tempting, but Evan will see uh, me for sure. Towards the Tabanga. <laughs> sounds like he's in the mood to get me in trouble. Well, you're going to have to describe what that is. I guess the totem thing, is that what you mean? Almost there. Oh, a very cool Chloe Price. Oh, thank you very much. Gotcha. And that's a cool photo. Oh, perfect. You're welcome. He walked like he shot himself. I hope he's okay. Thank you for your guidance. I needed that. I was struggling. It's Gosh. good to have you, Irene. I saw your recent now comments. Thank you very much for that one. Turn on the... <laughs> that works. Cool. Let's get the keys and the graffiti. It's clearly us. You know, we've just walked away from it really sheepishly. Very subtle. It always is sprinklers, isn't it? There is a common theme. Shows you how, you know, her and Max are, you know, different yet the same. Right. Guys, what do we want to graffiti? We can go for a squirrel peace offering or squirrel gives no fucks. One forgives no fucks. Peace offering. We're at a 1-1 one, one stalemate. Who's going to break it? Peace offering. Mm. Okay, well, we're going peace offering then. Poor Samuel. <laughs> he dropped some wisdom gospel on us and then we've graffitied his door. But then again, the bathroom was way worse, so. Oh, sorry about the bathroom. That's so weird. That what, Think about the timing. Damn. Sorry, Samuel. That's cool. Like, you know, vote's a vote. It's democracy. Right. Time to find Drew's room. We have to, uh, you know. You gotta go with your gut, you know. No time like the present. Tatjan is going to be evil when it comes to the. I uh, <laughs> oh, no, you are when it comes to the Rachel. Uh oh. Chloe? <laughs> hey, Skip. How's it going? Not that it isn't great to see you and all, but what are you doing here? Didn't you just get suspended? Relax. I'm just uh, visiting a friend. I can't, I really can't just let you go in. Oh, do we do back talk? Oh, pull skip. I guess we're doing back talk, aren't we? Right, I've won every one so far, but I don't know. I feel like, uh, okay, let's, let's give I'm it a go. Inside, dude. You're just Look, gonna I, I'm going to lock in here. I don't think I can. In fact, I think I have to ask you to state your official business or else vacate Blackwell property. Vacate business, what are we looking at here? I hate to do this to Skip, but okay, I, I've got to get inside. One. Maybe if I make him really uncomfortable, he'll feel guilty and let me pass. Oh, he, uh, we've got to win five, That's he's got to win business. 
women's business. Women's business, Skip. As in, my uterus? I need to use the restroom. Glad you asked. What? No. No, it's my job to ask, Chloe. You're gonna lose your job. If you keep violating students' personal rights, you're going to get fired. Oh, it's not like that. Do you know what Wells would do to me if I didn't, you know, patrol? Is Wells pressuring you to write more students up? I'm not even a student, but sure, don't let that stop you. I thought we were friends. Where is this coming from? I, I thought we were I'm locking too, in. But when the man comes down on you, you come down on me. Is that it? Look, look, look. I am really sorry, Chloe. I'm just so oh, dude. confused right now. Just look the other yeah. way. Yeah. It's not like I'm up to every criminal. I just need to use the bathroom. Fuck yeah. I don't know what to do. Seriously, my uterus is on fire, dude. Lovely is dude, that, but he's just... Uh, descriptive he doesn't... He, he wouldn't scream security really when you look at him, would you? Fuego utero, Skip. En fuego utero. I don't, I don't know what to say. If I'm you say so tits, sorry. does that work? I just thought it might have failed. I'm here. I've gotten reports of an unknown vehicle in the parking lot. Oh, thank God. Oh, I'm on it. I won't tell Wells. Do what you have to do, okay? I won't tell anyone. So, from memory, I think it's this thing with Drew, the Tempest, then Rachel's place. Frank. It's been 20. Okay, so Frank's impatient. Got it. And what does Mikey say? Um, ah, I'm sorry you got suspended. Yeah, I rolled one against. I get it. Steph says you're a nerd. Really? Because I thought Steph is right there. So. Looks like you just made that one up and you pulled out your ass, buddy. Go to Elliot's room, by the way. Oh, do we have to? What if he's in there? What if he tries to grope me or something? Oh, Chloe, you donut. Alright, which one is Drew's room? Oh no, the forest is on fire. Uh, thanks for the geometry help, I owe you Justin. Thou shall not pass, whiteboard. <laughs> Could Elliot be lamer if he tried? Okay, right, so... Is he in there? Elliot Hampton's room. Wonder what he's up to right now. So, science and music is what I'm getting. Elliot at. does work really hard. I guess I'm happy for him. The world breaks everyone, and afterward, some are strong at the broken places. Why does that make me sad? It's been so long since Elliot and I actually went to a concert together. I guess Elliot's still into Chloe, right? So, you know, it probably tears him up a little bit. Elliot's mom seems nice. Hey, Fleecy. Hey, sweetheart. Just go on her about your scholarship. They can be prouder. Oh, my God. Lucky Dana. <sighs> Warren Graham is such a nerd. <laughs> huh. There's way less porn here than I would have thought. Chloe Elizabeth. Chloe Elizabeth Price, Arcadia Bay. Elliot Hampton, Arcadia Bay. How to tie a tie video. Yeah, so he's definitely into me.
Oh, there's a picture of us. Wow. I remember this show. Crazy that Elliot would hold on to this picture after so long. That's not half bad. When she left the room, it was electric flushed wings to the bag in Okay. Dark. I see her in the brick and mortar in the fresh cut grass. Eyes flashing bright like coins. The ferryman can't have her, I say. But the dark gods laugh. Who is it that Elliot's writing about? He, I mean, us. The moment when the sun is almost there, the sea is so welcoming and warm. When poor light sees the, the nodding waves. When shapeless cold infinity conforms to one start playing. And for a moment only, all is possible. All say yes. My heart says yes. Her eyes say yes. Elliot is way more artistic than I thought. They see her but don't see her. How is that so? When all the world is a negative and dark and she cries out screaming rocket trailing fire. <laughs> Wait, are these about me? You're what the fuck, Elliot? Sky. How childish she is. How lovely and how cruel. How black no spilling words and dripping ink. Don't get me wrong, it's lovely. You know, good sentiment. It's just, it's what he does later. But it's the same with Warren and Max. A lot of people don't shit Warren and Max. Just because someone's nice to you doesn't mean you owe them. And that's the point I was making in the you know last episode. Uh, sorry, I was telling you before I leave the, for hating on Rachel. Oh, thank you. Please shoot your fight between good and evil. I like the dare. Well, I've never been able it's to fine because uh, for me. now we've I got... I guess um, either really good or <laughs> really bad. Multiple people to hate uh, on Rachel, so Elliot's we'll see where the votes take us. I'm, I'm excited way. to see what you guys pick. Maybe he does belong at Blackwell. Who would just leave their dorm open like that? I, I was so like when I was in a dorm, I was so like I locked the door all the time, you know. I just I, I couldn't trust it, you know. So I know Drew's up there to the left. So we've got break a leg tonight. Okay, so this is Drew. Oh, Hayden, even yeah. Um, lovely skater boy. Yep. Yeah. Uh, definitely Drew's room. And who's here? Right, okay. Oh, shit. Okay, there. I just not. Okay, I can graffiti. Uh, there's a there's a graffiti board, is there? Okay, I'll look at all of them till I find it. Just for let me know, guys. Ah, I see. I don't know how I didn't see that. Yeah, okay, we're going to have a very chaotic stream, as in, like, battles going on, you know. Uh, guys, Creeper or Poet, what are we picking? Uh, the thing is, oh, I wouldn't do this at all, though, because I feel like if they know it's you, it's like you're toying and pushing and pulling him, and I don't want to push and pull the guy, you know. He deserves better than that, at least, you know. Yeah, I'm the same, Sonia. I forgot so much. So we've got one for Poet, one for Creeper, one for Creeper... Is Tatiana going to tie it? If so, I'm going to have to get a coin out. Yeah, there we go. So, unless someone like Billy or Irene chimes in, and I'll give them until I flip this coin. If not, the coin is decided. I've got a £1 coin here. Uh, right, so we'll go Poet is heads, Creeper is tails. That's okay, Irene. Head, so we're going poet. Emotional, loyal, introverted, uh, odd, and talented. Which spells Elliot? Yeah, you're not wrong, Fleecy. Maybe I should have. I just remembered you've got Daughter Youth, which uh, I think I can play on guitar, actually, which is the song at the end of this. Oh, so Mikey... Good. 
sleeps Drew's here. not here. Okay. <laughs> if I were Drew, where would I hide my money? Bet the dinner choices are steak or steak. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. I didn't realize Drew was this good at sports. I bet he can't wait to get out of Arcadia Bay. Frank wasn't lying. Looks like Drew sells happy pills to his fellow meatheads. So many folks are shit out of luck around here. At least Drew has some prospects. Too bad I lost my release form. I was really looking forward to running all those sweaty laps. We might have failed to kill you, Durgaron. But something tells me Mikey's not through. <laughs> Bad guys don't usually look <laughs> awesome. That coach of ranks. <laughs> looks like Mikey's been staying here with Drew. Oh, it looks like there's uh, allegiances happening in the chat. I like it. Mikey's I like figures. it. <laughs> Playing that game yesterday was actually fun. <laughs> they look so happy. Oh, man. Looks like Drew's dad is having a hard time. <sighs> is the money in there? All right. Guess I have to crack a four-digit code. Plenty of possible combinations here. Right, okay, April the 3rd, 92, December the 27th, 96, so we'll go for his birthday. We'll go 4392 maybe, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give that a go. Damn it, Okay. Wrong numbers. His, uh, maybe just the, the year. So let's just go 1992. Oh, I hit back. I'm an idiot. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, let's, let's try that. 1992. Damn it. Okay. Wrong numbers. Uh, oh, yeah, we're in... Sorry. Yeah, we're in America, aren't we? Jesus. Because they're fucking weird. They do it the wrong way around. I hit back again. Why do I do that? Why, why would back be there and apply beyond the light? It makes no sense. I'm trying to defend, like, something really tiny here. But, okay, so it's the April the 3rd, 92, apply. Damn it. Fuck. Wrong number. <laughs> oh, God, right. Okay, so it's not that. Um, maybe... Okay, maybe it's just the, the month and the day. So we'll go 04, 03. Damn it. Hmm. Wrong numbers. <laughs> I'm very sorry, it's the sheet. Oh, okay. Uh, right. Um, maybe it's the brother. He was born uh, in 1996. We've tried that one. But he's born in the 27th of the 12th. But we go months first. So the 12th of the 27th. Maybe he's done his, his brother's birthday. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Maybe that should be a comedy right. short right there, guys. I got there, though. I got there. Oh. Did little Drew beat you up, too? And I didn't need anybody's help. Well, I needed guidance. I would have been there for fucking years if you guys didn't tell me that months go first in America. I forgot about that. Thing is, I just knew to go to that clue with the birthdays because when I was like, there's, there's a digit code, I'm like, usually it's a birthday. Okay. Got the money. Time to bust out of here. We're not going to make it out though, are we? Hey, Elamon. Chloe? What are you doing here? I got lost. 
I was <laughs> looking for your brother, but uh, he's not here, so. Why? Bro, we gotta go. Yesterday wasn't enough? You wanna go another round? Doesn't matter. Mikey, get your stuff, let's move. <laughs> All the bedrooms are that way, and he's Shit. looking towards the bathroom. You're making me think you're nervous about something. Kiss him. Is that an option? Drew, what's going on? Don't worry about it. Stay in here, and don't say anything, little brother. Whatever you do, don't open the door. You know what's going on? Damon, you shouldn't have come here. Okay, the choice is coming up, guys. You guys Where are picking. Where is the place to collect my fucking money? Shit. I told you, I don't have it. Sales are down. All oh, right. <laughs> Nobody wants to get high right now. But look, it's spring season. We just started two a day. Those are going to kill us. I'll be able to sell all the oxy you've got. Drew, you owe me a grand. Where is it? I Do not I open the door. Right open the... Well, we're at 1-1. One, one. I know in my blind playthrough I saved him. Tough time. Yeah. Bet a grand would mean a lot to him right now. Where's my money, Drew? I don't know what you expect me to do. I can't just make money appear out of thin air. Oh, I want my fucking money! You don't have to hit me, man. I'm good. Oh. Where is it? Oh. Please! Just give me one week. Oh. You're just going to lie there? I thought football players... Did we agree before, did we? I mean, way back then, but at the same time, it's a vote, you know. No one steals from me. No one. Fuck. Fuck. Okay, guys, uh, let the voting commence. Give Damon the money or stay with Mikey. What are you picking? I think I see, like, what, one, two, three, four, five of you that are kind of, like, active right now, so we should get a majority. Okay, so we have opened the door, meaning, okay, so that's free for give the money, right? Four for open, so everyone is opening. I think Tatjana swayed it by saying that's what helps us play D&D. A one for stay. I'm sorry, Irene, you're getting outvoted. I think we're giving Damon the money. Yeah, there's no way. Four for open. Yeah, okay. Okay, I, I've got your money. Ah, I didn't realize we had an audience. Hey, Mikey. Okay. Who the hell are you? He almost looks a little bit like Johnny Depp. Frank sent me to collect. That's what Frank was going on about? Wait, are you the bitch who tuned up Sheldon? That guy at the mill yeah that doesn't matter water under the so bridge what? he'll recover anyway i've only I'm ever here. seen it where you open the door i don't really know what happens if you don't actually frank was right about you let's see the cash nah <laughs> johnny that was hot we need that <laughs> It's all here. Mikey, you need to help your big brother. Help him understand that I take this shit seriously. Come on. Mikey's got nothing to do with this, man. You help your brother understand that if he steals from me again, I'm coming back here and I'm going to break his knees. Thanks, kid. Tell Frank I owe him one. Yeah, that's the thing, and I imagine he would get injured, and I think I've seen the still with him in a wheelchair or on crutches, so I we feel like... You just screwed us over. Are you crazy? That guy could have killed you. You don't know anything about this situation. It's none of your business. I, 
I was trying to help. Damon wasn't going to stop until he had that money. <laughs> Do we still get 10% of so. You think you're some kind of hero? Stepping in for poor Nathan Prescott? And now you're messing with our lives? Uh, Mikey, uh, I gotta look at your arm. Uh, Just leave us alone. Uh, look. Uh, I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't get our dad off the streets. I feel like... I don't remember this to the point maybe I did stay with Mikey in my blind play for it. We'll be okay. Yeah, because I had the option to give money to other people afterwards, so I must have done. Hmm. Well, depends. <laughs> I kind of think I know what you mean by that. Oh, Tempest time. Guys, I remember we have to revise the script. So we're, we're, I'm going to give you all responsibility to remember certain lines. We're, this is going to be a team effort and we're going to we're gonna own the Tempest together, okay? Because I'm pretty sure I looked at it on my blind paper. I, like, I wonder if, if we have to memorize that. And then we had to and I butchered it and I was like, I even said it and I didn't remember. God, there's more Snoop than Snoop Dogg's tour bus. But do you want to do it right, Liam? I mean, yeah, I guess it might be funny, because I remember, like, the drama teacher makes some pretty funny remarks if you fail it, but... Do you remember it by heart? Damn, Slashin. I love this, like, that Life is Strange, like, sound, you know? Oh, that was a ruse, Fleecy. Come on, that guy's never getting sober. This day has been so messed up. Mikey's arm is broken. Drew told me about what happened. Shit, I didn't know it was that bad. The situation's so fucked up. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Thanks, I will. D Does Mike get his arm broken either way? Mikey, even. Because, like, if the door's shut, I guess. I don't remember that. I must have picked the other option before. Of all the possible scenarios involving Victoria Chase and swords, this one is easily the least exciting. Did Doug dig David After all the work Steph did, it's amazing that she would drop everything to be there for Mikey. Hey, Dana. Did Doug dig David's garden? Or did David dig Doug's? Did Doug dig How David's garden? How did I know? Did Doug dig David's garden? Up, Mr. Keaton. Why, if it isn't the muse of the Blackwell Drama Department. Last time I played, Tell she me complimented me. I had the red shirt with the crows and he lost it. <laughs> sure, I think so. But it's a lot weirder and scarier than poets and pop songs make it out to be. <laughs> you might be surprised, my dear. Budding dramaturge. May your propitious appearance come Samantha, the okay, I'll Stephanie speak to Gingrich's Samantha next. Sudden recusal. An emergency, she says. Uh -huh. Word. Stephanie was our lion of the light board, but platitudinal though it may be, the show must sojourn forth. That dude is weird. Right, where is this Samantha? There you are. Pissing in the cool. What are you doing? Are you perving on Nathan? Oh, Samantha, you're in over your head, love. Hey, Samantha. Shh. Nathan. Please. I can't do it, Dad. I'm sorry. Keep. You don't understand. They all hate me. They're just going to laugh at me. Why do you suppose that is? I 
don't know. Because you show weakness. Just like you're doing right now. What the Dad? Dad? When will you learn that this isn't about you and your problems? This is about the Prescott name. My name. You will not embarrass me. Nathan. Yes. Good. Now. Break a leg. I'll see you after the show. He's not even gonna watch the show. Yeah, let's say something. Great okay. pep talk, Mr. P. Everyone knows the best way to instill confidence in someone is by intimidating them. I don't know who you are, but mind your own business. <laughs> I'd love to. Don't you have, like, a private bunker filled with gold coins where you could have these conversations? <laughs> Nathan. Yeah, you might be right, Tatjana, actually. Hey, Nathan's dad is some ass. Oh my god, he does have a private no. bunker. That went over I my head. Just but... go away and leave him alone. Nathan's dad sucks. But you should be careful what you wish for when it comes to parents. Oh, Chloe, I wasn't thinking. I'm sorry. For what? You didn't kill my dad. Or did you? <laughs> <laughs> that was a joke. I know. Your dark sense of humor reminds me a lot of Nathan's. Actually, the two of you are really similar. Uh, what the hell does that mean? I'm serious. Oh, there's a choice. You're both artistic and surprisingly sensitive. You've been through a lot, and a lot of people unfairly judge you for it. I think you stood up for Nathan yesterday because you know what he's going through. Nathan's hurt, and he needs help. But whenever I try to help him, it always seems to make things worse. If you were Nathan right now, what would you want me to do? Okay, I'll let you guys pick. Are we give him up? No, 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 no. Baby, give him up. Give him up. Oh, are we going to give him help or give him space? Give up. Space. Give him help. Oh my god, it's a freeway tie. Jesus Christ, guys. Gonna wait a bit for the answer. So two for help, two for space. Okay, so... Um, two for space, two for help. So, unfortunately, Fleecy, you haven't won. I'm going to have to flip a coin between space and help. I wonder what I'd pick personally, though. It's a tough one. There is no real right answer. Uh, right, okay. Uh, let's go... Unless Billy votes, of course. I'll give him three seconds. Okay, space will go heads, help will go tails. It is tails, so we're going to say help. Unless Billy votes in three to give up. Oh, okay, so... Oh, so it's like, is, is that actually a three-way tie? How the fuck do I do this? Right, I'm going to spin a wheel for you guys, okay? That is it. We're, we're going to make it completely random. Random wheel generator. Wheel of names. Um, right, uh, clear the board. Right, give him up. Oh, I, I've typed that horror. Give him up. Give him space. Or give him help. I should have just said help, space, and up. I've written the whole phrase out. Right, okay, so uh, yellow is give him help. Give him space is red. Give him up is blue. Uh, there we go. Completely honest. And the winner is... 
Give him space. So yeah. Oh, have I counted that wrong? Well, either way, it looks like uh, space wins. I'm just gonna do it, guys. <laughs> when I'm super angry, I need to let it all out. The last thing I want is someone trying to calm me down. Case in point, how pissed he was when we tried to help him yesterday. If I were you, I'd give him space and wait for him to come to you. <sighs> that actually makes sense. Is there- can someone tell me if there's a variation and the consequence to that choice then? Hey, Hayden. Address me as Ferdinand, good lady. Ferdinand. Uh, alright. Um, hey, Ferdinand. Sup, Chloe. I mean, sup, fair maiden. Great. Uh, method acting. Really? Thanks. Oh, really? Okay. Uh, either feel free to share them. If not, um, I'll find out myself. I reckon Rachel's in there. This is probably the men's because this is where Nathan went. So let's give Nathan a little spy spy. Boys changing tent. Okay, maybe not. Thanks, but no thanks. I don't know really is it a good idea to like hound them though. RA will suck as Prospera. If VC had any talent, maybe she would have gotten the part. Talent? Is that what got Mr. K to cast you, Slut? Guess they don't call it drama for nothing. Yeah, uh, so is Samantha actually like one of the victims of Mr. Jefferson then? Is her name like in a red folder or something then? Man, I hope Mikey's okay. Okay, uh, right. Rachel? Oh, come on, V. You got Oh, that doesn't look right. You got this. Oh, shit, shit, shit. I can't do this. I'm going to ruin the play. What are you two doing here? Or did you forget? You let this loser dropout sabotage you. But really, I should be thanking you. Now I have everything I wanted. I don't think they should have like changed it because like remasters aren't supposed to tinker too much, are they? Please leave so I can get ready for my performance. Even though I wish I was the one performing tonight, they could have easily made Samantha a girl who, whose name was a girl who had a folder though. That would have been a cool bit of continuity. Dark but cool. Oh, okay. Uh, guys, tell me what we're doing. Are we back talking or supporting Victor? Well, we're not going to do that. We're back talking. But I, I just, I really need a pee, guys. So I'm just going to leave it awkwardly on the screen while I do that. Right. Du -du -du. Oh, we've got some support here. Are we actually picking support? Damn, okay. Oh, you heard the pee. No, nah, don't worry about it. I wanted you guys to hear. Nah, you guys need to hear me on the toilet. Nah, nah, come on, guys. There's no fun in that. Okay, well, I guess we're supporting Victoria. You know what? It'll be interesting. I've never really seen that, so... Yeah, I am a certain dominance. 
My stream, my rules. I guess. I mean, even if you are super lame to me all the time, I hope you don't completely suck up there. And even if you do suck, who cares? I mean, let's be real. You're not Rachel. But that's okay, because you're Victoria Chase. You know? Even if you suck. Oh my god. Thank you. Oh, that's exactly what I needed to hear. Uh, okay. Cool. Tea? Oh, so Rachel spikes her anyway. Instrument. We want you at your best tonight. Oh, were they in on it together? Okay, V. Time to shine. I don't know how I feel about it. Did we just roof here? Oh, Christ, that was epic. You distracted her just long enough for me to slip those pills into her teeth. Hey, dude. Oh, hey. Uh, that's mine. Ah, you it's guys had a plan. A you know, it symbolizes sudden change. I always pegged you for the dramatic type. I blame the company I keep. No spiking. Ah, okay. Oh, uh, cheers, okay. guys. I better start getting into costume before... Sweet party. We're ruined. The show is ruined. That was quick. My dear young artists, a misfortune most unkind has befallen us. Juliet is waylaid. That infernal inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. Would that she could but manifest on her master's whim as a true spirit. Alas, devoid of an understudy, the situation is a dire one indeed. I'm afraid we may have to cancel. Truly, we are a cursed lot. Even my prodigious imagination cannot conceive One thing I find really sweet is that when you do the play, Joyce texts you and says, I would have loved to have seen that. Oh, wow, I had nearly hit the lamppost. Touché. Mr. Keaton, perhaps I could fill in for Victoria? My dear, your visage is as a vessel sent by the heavens to offer passage to my stranded soul. But I'm afraid without our Ariel, all is still lost. What? Uh, uh, oh, no. Mr. Keaton, no. Chloe could step in for Juliet. No fucking chance. At least until the road's clear. The romantic. She's the right fit for Juliet's costume. She is indeed. Tell me, my dear, have you ever acted before? Hell no. Did you guys ever do drama in school? Play or plays or theaters or anything? Time. And she's fantastic at it. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of the production rests upon your slender shoulders? I'd say you're super fucked. Chloe, please. For me. Oh, I don't use that guilt trip. <sighs> Damn it. <laughs> I love that cat. That is, I really like the makeup, to be fair. Me into this. Hurry up, I just talked to Damon, good work. You can meet me tomorrow to pick up your cut. Your friend's an asshole. What matters is he's happy. Whatever. Price. You did the right thing. Yeah, we did. I mean, Mikey, I, uh, Drew isn't battered, is he? So it probably is the right thing. I know who goes there. Right, guys, uh, script time. We're, we're going to rehearse some lines, okay? We had a theatre at school, but I didn't participate but watched two plays. I sucked at acting, but I have a friend that studied Thanks, performing Rachel. arts. I, I did. I, I used to act in school plays. Um, I, I, yeah, I picked GCSE drama. Right, okay. So, okay, we're doing yellow lines. Right, I'm going to pick you guys at random, okay? Slasheen, your line one. You've got to remember... All hail, great mistress, I come to answer thy best pleasure. Okay, lock it in. I can't remember who I nominated for that one. 
I think I said Slasheen. Slasheen, that's your line. Next, we'll go Tatjana. Tatjana, you've got to remember. I boarded the king's ship. In every cabin, I flamed amazement. The fire and cracks of sulfur the roaring. The almost mighty Neptune seemed to bestead to make his bold waves tremble. Okay? Lock that in. That's your line, Tatjana. At the bottom, we're going to go for Fleecy. Not a soul. The king's son, Ferdinand, was the first man that leaped. Cried, hell is empty and all the devils are here. Uh, Felice, you're up next. Not a hair perished, and as thou thou batst me, I have dispersed them about the island in troops. Okay? That is you, Sonia, okay? Um, I don't know if Billy's here or not. Irene, are you here? If you, do you want a line? Um, I'll go for this one. Is there more toil? Let, re let me remember thee what thou hast promised. Is there more toil? Let me remember thee what thou hast promised. Oh, there's more lines. Okay. Uh, Irene, you can do this lot because they're all small. You've got my liberty. That's my noble mistress. And then we exit and we're done, okay? Have we all got that? Who wants refreshing of their parts? Because we're going to smash this as a team. I don't want anyone butting in on other people's lines. We've got our own... I honestly want Liam to let us choose every single option. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, do we all know our lines? Sonia, your one is... Not a hair perished, and as that thou batst me, I have dispersed them about the isles in troops. Okay, I'll let you read that one for a bit. Oh, and we have to climb to the top of the shipwreck at that point. Okay, right, if we fail, we fail, it's funny. But, um, let's graffiti some stuff then. When life gives you lipstick, use it to tag shit. Death. We had it. I'm picking this one. Why not? Tatjana says I want us to get every option. Nah, I'm doing this one. I might have to leave. Okay, Irene, I'll try and remember your lines. If not, Slasheen can jump in. They know every line. Slasheen was born for How Ariel. I feel like Steph is mocking me from afar. Right, okay. Uh... But thank you for joining, Irene. It was lovely having you. Hopefully we can see you in more. The only thing worse than looking at spandex... Yeah, is Sonia, being forced this, to wear it. this is your moment. The spotlight comes on you. Right, so order-wise, I'm pretty sure it goes Slasheen, Tatjana, Felici, Sonia, myself, and then we're going to wing the end. Okay, guys, it's show time, show business. Let's go. By accident, most strange, bountiful fortune. Slashin, you're up. Nine enemies brought to the shore. Here, cease more questions. Thou art inclined to sleep. Tis a good dullness, and give it way. I know, thou canst not choose. Come away, servant. Come. Ah, shit. I'm on. <gasps> oh, uh, that's I you. I am ready now. Get up there. Approach, my Ariel. Come. Damn it. No problem. I've got this. I just walk to Rachel and say my line. Bye. No, let's go. Let's, let's do it seriously. <laughs> Ugh, killed my eyes. Uh, hello. <sighs> All hail, great mistress. I, uh, I can't. Oh, shit. Okay, Slashin, don't worry. You're helping me at the end, okay? Most fearless, generous spirit. Tatjana, you're up. Must thou perform to point the tempest that I bade thee? What, what, what is it, Tatjana? I'm saying what you say.
It's got to be A or D. <laughs> it's not W. I boarded the king's ship. I boarded the king's ship. In every cabin, I flamed amazement. The fire and cracks of sulfurous roaring, the most mighty Neptune seemed to besiege and make his bold waves uh, tremble. My brave spirit, who was so firm, so constant, that this coil would not infect his reason. Uh, not a soul. The king's son, Ferdinand, was the first man that leaped from his ship and cried. Is that you, Fleecy? Hell is. I think I remember this one. But I'll let Fleecy say it. Hell is empty. That's what I thought it was. Cried. <clears throat> Hell is empty and all the devils are here. Yes. Yeah, I got that one wrong in my blame play for He was like, oh, if only. Safe? All right. I guess this is when I'm supposed to walk somewhere. Oh, it said the ship. I go to the ship. Not a hair perished. And uh, as thou baddest me, I have dispersed Oh, it is, isn't it? The aisle. Okay, I, this was uh, Sonya's line, I think. Um, if not, though, I think I remember what it is. It's very confusing in the German version where the line is something different. Oh, yeah, because, yeah, that's where you're from, Tatjana. Okay, uh, Sonia, if you're not here in free, I'll do it myself. <laughs> no, you don't. You love me. I'll do it in troops. You are correct. It is in troops. In troops. See, you gotta believe in yourself. Oh, Ariel, thy charge exactly is performed. But there's more work. Oh shit. I don't know. Uh oh, this was my line as well. I think it's more toil. Is there more toil? Let me remember. Because lines would just be the joke answer, right? Promised. How now? What is thou canst demand uh boom and we've got it we had this one before well irene knew it was liberty my liberty indeed thy liberty nay this most of all i will not grant Th that's not her line is it? What's going on? But thou hast promised. But thou assured my freedom. Didn't thou? I never said how dearly I hold thee. My habit's been to keep my soul well draped. Most loyal spirit, companion, and friend is acting in my service. I forget she goes off script. This is cool. Excitement, amusement, and delight. Of course, mistress. Most truly, it is so. Mr. Keat, they're way Shh. off script. It's magical. Then why, I pray you, wish you to be free? Excitement ages quickly. And I fear if we set out in search of new... Uh, fun, you'll tire of me, and uh, then I'll. I think wrong. this answer goes more in line with the Samuel quote from earlier. In my grasp. I will not bend, I will not see thee flying forth alone. The envy would be more than I could bear. So come with me. Is that not in thy power? Spirit, take my hands. Most faithful friend, for but a little longer I beseech. Continue in thy service to my schemes. 
and when they are complete maybe i'm just a I sucker for them but this is just kind of like why i ship I rachel and chloe a little bit more than the average person you. because i just feel like at the time I of chloe's life so she needed her and she needed her that. as well what sayest thou to my most hopeful wish despite the fact that i do agree that yes i am most pleased rachel isn't perfect but who is your duty done for now so go forth hence with haste i've work to do you crushed it so good you're a born person. and i think it goes for the writing better I'll you know be the fact that when she does year. betray her it hurts Henry, chloe Henry. more absolutely transformative i am humbled thanks what the hell just happened was that real Shake it off. Come on. We'll visit Caliban, my slave. Caliban? Why not Calamastia? Sir, I do not love to look on. He does make our fire. Fetch in our wood. What ho? Slave! Caliban! Come forth, Come I say! On! Uh... Mm. As wicked do, as e'er my mother brushed. Thou poisonous slave, got by the devil himself. Filth as thou art, I have lodged thee in mine own cell, till thou didst seek to violate the honor of my child. Oh, nugget. Come back. Shit. He's crying. Fetch us in fuel, and be quick. So, slave, hence. Fuck you. Where should this music be? In the air? Or the earth? Oh, thank God. This play is super. Intense. Elder Maxon in Fallout 4 hating on androids the same way like the cops and the form. humans in Detroit become human. It is a spirit. No wench. It eats and sleeps and hath such senses as we have. I will resist such entertainment. Put thy sword up, traitor. Do you? Love me? Oh heaven, oh earth, bear witness to this sound. I beyond all limit of what else in the world do love, prize. Ad victorium his for the brotherhood. Down his beard like winter's drops from eaves of reeds. Go release them, Ariel. My charms I'll break. Justice Their for paladin dance, I say. Restore, and they shall be themselves. Now my charms are all o'erthrown, and what strength I have's mine own. Pray, release me from my bands, with the help of your good hands. Very good, bravo. I particularly was amazing. No, I say I. We were amazing. We smashed it. Nathan didn't. He just said fuck you and stormed off. I don't know why he's still there. So See, I do think, you know, it's just very symbolic. Rachel pushes Chloe out and of her comfort zone, and she actually enjoyed doing that, and, you know, you could argue she needs a Rachel type figure. But, yeah, that's the thing, guys, with the whole Jefferson thing and Frank. There's so much debate around it. It's quite murky, isn't it? Yeah, no, I get what you mean, Slashine. I agree with that. Oh, it's that girl looking on. 
the forever mysterious girl in the white dress. Towards the end of the game, guys, we're coming up with like a pretty major choice towards the end here. <laughs> oh my god, Keaton's face behind you when you walked on stage? <laughs> I was shitting myself. In your night, I'll make you in my sleep. <laughs> he was shitting himself. <laughs> that dude owes in me. The light, you wake up next to me. I really like this neighborhood as well, just like the look of it. I don't know, Arcadia Beige just has this magical feel about it. Definitely is kind of like my second virtual home in a way, you know, like, I love escaping on this game so much. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of our production rests upon your slender shoulders. Hey Joshua, good to see you ma'am. Hope you're doing okay. We're coming to the winter of the episode now. Like that on stage. Yeah, right? You know, you, like seriously, I love nights after a show. <laughs> Is it always like this? Oh, totally. It's such a high. No more nerves, just the adrenaline. So, first timer, are you proud of yourself? You were literally perfect tonight. I was blown away. Yeah, I feel really awesome. If you told me this morning I'd be this happy tonight. You've gone through so much shit today. Right now is pretty good. Okay, the whole show was good. I admit it. Yeah. <laughs> it was magical. Okay, guys, I'll let you choose here. What are we doing? <laughs> this is where the chaos begins, because it's like, you know, we're gonna, like, have the anti-Rachel people come in and alter this. But that's the name of the game. I did say so. I promised you. Or we could just wait here and leave her hanging so she awkwardly has her hand out for a few hours. Okay, so, um, say something sweet, say something silly, hold her hand. So there's one for all of them there, lovely. Not three ties again. Well, it's happened, Slishing, unless someone sways it. Oh my god, why you guys decide that? I've got a little present for you all. Hold on. Check who's still with us. Hey, buddy. I have a little surprise for you all. She's not doing too good, but she's fighting. It's Ruby. So, she has cancer in her bowel, and she's not got long left, but she's fighting through the medication like a trooper. And I'm really proud of her. And she's powering like mad right now. I don't know if you can hear that, but yeah, she's powering. Okay, so what did we say? Uh, we've got sweet, hold her hand, silly. Um, Sonia with the tiebreaker. I'm gonna go fleecy, say something silly. Okay, so. Cool. You can stay with us if you like, buddy, but I understand if you wanna go. Okay, so we, we're saying, go into the LSM section, it should take you there. Right, say something silly. I know, right? I know, right? So, I love you too. What do you think? Should I run away? Oh, what's this? Actress? You got a clump of fur there, buddy. Let's leave. For real. <laughs> oh, hello. For real, huh? You said you wanted to skip town and never look back. Like I said last night, let's do it. <laughs> I know. I've been thinking about that all day, but that was... <laughs> Don't say it was just a crazy thought. You mean it. I can tell. You want this. Yeah, but, like, 
eventually. Let's go now. Didn't we already agree on stage? We can't just... <laughs> Why not? Um... I know, I think you're right, Sonia. Thank you for saying that. Uh... Fine then, drama queen. Where are we going? <laughs> you tell me. What uniquely twisted location does Chloe Price plus Rachel Amber equal? Hmm. <laughs> oh, I didn't know there were variations of it. I think we have to go Los Angeles because that's where they kind of dreamed of going and I want to go for continuity. Why don't you show me LA? Perfect. 60 degrees every night. You and me on the Santa Monica Pier. Forging on food truck food. Smoking up. Looking at the moon shining on the waves. Uh, I love this time of night. <laughs> Don't you just feel like everything's possible? <laughs> Rachel, stop. If you don't mean this, it's... It's just making me feel like shit that this life you're describing isn't going to happen. For fuck's sake! I've never been more serious in my life. <laughs> no, Steph Gangrich ain't gonna be happy. <sighs> Chloe, what would it take to convince you? Your bracelet, a tattoo, a kiss. Okay, and this is where we decide, guys. I'll let you pick. Majority wins. Vamanos. What would you pick, Ruby? Eh? Okay. Tattoo, tattoo, kiss the girl bracelet. So we've got two, one, one. I mean, I know in my blind playthrough I picked a kiss, but... Anyone else to sway? If I don't get an answer in five seconds, I'm saying tattoo. Is tattoo the lamest option, is it? I'm guessing tattoo is the least romantic one, I don't know bad options. Well, it looks like the Rachel haters are in full force tonight, and I have to go with the majority, so we are going to pick Tattoo. Give me a promise. In ink. Like, a contract? Nope. I mean, I'm not going to lie, I, I, I always go for romance that, like, it might be quite interesting for me to see what happens if it doesn't happen, I don't know. Oh really? I wonder the significance of the bracelet then. This is temporary. The deal is, you get it done for real. Then, I'll believe you. Okay. What if I said let's leave, tonight? Mm. Really? What is this? It's obviously a sign! So? What do you say? Sorry buddy, I got a wire on your head. Let's go sneak some clothes and stuff from my house. For you or for me? I gotta say, my clothes look damn good on you. Cool. Let's do it. And then we'll get the hell out of Arcadia Bay. Fuck yes. Should we escape to Arcadia Bay, Ruby? Just you and me? Oh, 
such a nice house. Iconic as well. Just say it because, as Liam pointed out, it's a very fast thing, so they don't know if it's love. That's the thing. I feel like Chloe is probably in that situation where her home life is so broken that she like is probably in an easier situation to say yes. So, which is interesting that Rachel's the one pulling away, but equally Chloe probably sees that and questions her validity and how serious she is about it. Oh, you're home. Rose, Rachel's home. And she um, brought her new friend. Our surprise star returns. You're just in time. Dinner's almost ready. Why weren't you at Chloe, the play? It? Nailed it. I must have been pretty memorable. You were. I get the sense that you're used to making an impression. Rachel, honey. You were resplendent tonight. Thanks. Chloe, you must join us for dinner tonight. Uh, she must? I must? Of course. I made chicken a la king. I'm sure you both acted up quite the appetite. Thanks. But I, I was just gonna stop in for a sec and then bounce. What are you meowing oh, for? Did you have other dinner plans? Dinner plans? I always thought dinner was something that just sort of happens. Chloe, I know we didn't exactly meet each other at our best this morning, but with you and Rachel becoming such fast friends, I insist you join us for dinner. Don't you agree, Rachel? Yes, of course, Chloe. Would you join us for dinner, please? Uh, of course. Great. I just need to wash off. Then I'll be right down. Don't be long. In the meantime, perhaps you can help me with the table, Chloe? Sure thing, <laughs> Mrs. Amber. Okay, yeah, I remember this okay. being like a fairly I'm long scene. But... After dinner, we can make our break. You cool down here? Totally. Your parents love me. They're good at coming off that way, but don't let your guard down. And Chloe, we just need to make it through dinner. A lot of Rose love her. That, you know, I don't really remember too much yeah, about her, so I'm gonna have to see why you mean that. Exactly. Just some quality time. I had you were in the tempest. So yeah, it was kind of a big deal. Oh shit, I, I went off that. Uh, you get two medals for good deeds today. Mikey's okay, Drew text you an update in a bit. Oh shit, so I'm back in the With the Ambers. What could possibly go wrong? Hello, sir. Hiya, Mr. Amber. I'm with Tatjana oh. on that one. I okay, think dude. Joyce is a good person still. Your daughter's pretty great. Oh, good line Thank to open that. You. We're fond of her as well. You ever feel like she's so awesome at everything that you just want to shake her? That's weird. Yeah. Uh, uh, me neither. What do you think? I thought Rachel was perfectly cast. She certainly was. We're very proud of her. I had no idea they were going to do that. Do what? I don't know the name for it. Uh, Reverse casting? Casting a, a woman as a man? Oh, I just meant the wizard part. Uh, I suppose that's also true. Bye. I don't really want to know Duty about the calls. other stuff. This, this conversation's <laughs> hey, dry. Good chat, Mr. Amber. Mm-hmm. I don't know. If I had a daughter and they invited a friend home, I'd be at the table getting to know them. I wouldn't be on my fucking newspaper. Let's just use the laptop mm, in front of them. was bad enough without having to read about it afterwards. Hope Mikey's okay, though. Chloe held it down like a champ. Hmm. How to clear browser history, followed by a gap for all of yesterday. That's like 
cheating asshat 101. Poor Rachel. I like how we just uh, not Oh, we have some dialogue choices. <laughs> oh, okay. Holy shit. That's the guy who attacked Drew. I'm glad I gave him the cash. Damon Merrick. Oh, Sh Sheldon's different. I always thought Sheldon and Damon were the same person because they have like the same face and hair. Oh my god, I remembered that wrong then. That would be why he didn't recognize me. Bye, Ruby. Love you. I'll see you later, yeah? I guess some families actually go to Paris instead of just talk about it their whole lives. Oh, that's sad because they were gonna. And what well, they did in the alternate version where Chloe was disabled. Easy to see who wears the literary pants around here. Oh, Fleecy, is that so? Monster worse than D David. I mean, huh. the whole thing that kicks Chloe Rachel to the curb, there really are definitely no flaws there, but I still think it. Joyce is a good person, but I don't I know. That in the bud. Everything about this house is nicer, cleaner, better, and more... Glasses. It is really interesting to see, like, Damn. Chloe in this environment. The embers are fancy as shit. But maybe this is all, like, fake, and this is what Rachel hates. I don't know. Damn. wonder if this is a family heirloom. <gasps> oh, I... I think that's an original who gives a shit. Improve. Uh, I'll let you guys pick. Oh, cool. So we've got. Yuck. Raven was one of them. That continuity there with the spirit animals. Pretty cool. And Mob. I'm just gonna, while you guys vote, I'm gonna catch up on your words. She's responsible for her kid, first and foremost. She keeps a man who beats her kid around because she's selfish. For me, Joyce is a hardworking person that is working her ass for that does not upset. Yeah, Chloe lost this far when she your husband. That's way more than the mistake. Okay, interesting. Right, I, I'm just gonna do it. It's a nothing thing. Let's go illiterate. It. Great way to make a good impression. I mean, it's on me. I'm the one who. Dur, 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 dur. Does that count as a graffiti? I'm just opening random cupboards, no hoping skeletons. to find uh, the next golden frame. Shiny dishes, though. Find out about the new DPA game or oh, Drew update. No way, I'm sorry, I had no idea what to do, that was so fucked. It's okay, Mikey's alright, I'm all sorry, he says thanks, tell him I said hey, will do. Something about this photo doesn't seem right. I should fix it. Oh, so that's what we have to graffiti. Oh, we can do it straight away. I can't tag this while Rachel's mom is right there. She totally bust me. I guess I'd do it in a minute then. I like how she's just at someone's house and she's just tagging random shit. Hey there, Mrs. Amber. Chloe, I'm so glad you're joining us tonight. So, uh, Rachel was pretty awesome tonight. She sure was. And I imagine whatever trick the two of you pulled to get her back on stage was even more dramatic than the play. We can be very persuasive together. Persuasive. Yes, that's a word for it. I guess what I will say, though, Felicity, is that in Life is Strange 1, so. don't they gang up on David and Joyce sides with Chloe so. when they find you out what uh, David's been doing? It's still so there is definitely a line. Maybe I'm remembering that one wrong, though. So, you putting me to work, or what? Yes. If you could please take four plates from the cupboard and set them on the table. Uh, what if I can't? Excuse me? You said if I could. Never mind. You're a riot, Chloe. 
All right, Chloe. You've set the table without ruining someone's marriage before. Piece of cake. Oh crap, what, what did we have to do? It was uh, plates on table. Not those plates. What plates? I can't access the plates. Maybe they were in here. Okay, cool. It's off to the table with you. Yeah, so does... I, I didn't know about that. So does uh, she find out about her hitting Chloe and then does nothing? I don't remember that detail. But if so, yeah, I guess her, my opinion of her, her would go down a bit. God, Tatjana, we're in sync tonight. We're asking the same questions at the same time. I would have liked to have seen that. Oh, bless her. Her, her ears were burning. Uh, right, that's all done. What is our current object? Talk to Rose. We can do that. Yes, Chloe? Plates, check. Anything else? Actually, could you be a dear and ask Mr. Amber what he'd like to drink with dinner? I will be a dear. Talking to James. As long as I can have can't tag this while well, Rachel's mom is right there. She totally bust me. What would you like for a drink, sir? Something else? What's your vice, Mr. Amber? I'm sorry? Your wife wants to know what kind of drink you're having. Ah, let's say sherry. Okay. One, two, three, sherry. Comical. Chloe, maybe you can help me understand something. I'll give it a shot. Rose and I, we're worried about Rachel. Yesterday was so unlike her. What do you suppose is going on? Myself. Oh. Um, besides all my bad behavior rubbing off on her, you mean? Hmm. Another oh, joke. I picked the wrong one, Sushin. Sorry. It seemed like you and Wells were happy to believe that this morning. Rachel is my her bad. own person. She's responsible you coming up? for her. Hey, actions. buddy, come on. I'd be lying. If I said I didn't have concerns about your friendship... I'm glad about that, because right. this is what Before the Storm Perhaps does for exactly me. It makes us believe in Chloe more. She navigates the hey, buddy, I can't see the screen. You coming? Oh, you giving me uh, kisses, you? Thanks. Right, let's get a sherry. Get a sherry and I'll graffiti the thing. Yes? Chloe? The boss man would like a sherry. Thank you. The glasses are in the china cabinet. You can place one at his setting. I know, right? Ruby's How am I supposed back. to get to China? Oh, Chloe. <laughs> it's the fancy looking cabinet, right? You got it. I like how the two cupboards she opened before happened to be the ones. I feel like maybe, I don't know. It's Nitpick. Uh, it's the triangle shaped one. Basic shapes. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Of course, he's ahead of the table. I know. I know, buddy. Or afterwards, if you want, we can have a cuddle. You can have a snack if you like, whatever you want. Maybe we could watch a movie tonight. How does that sound, buddy? Yeah? Should you watch Kill Bill yes, 2? Yes, Chloe? Because we've watched Kill Bill 1, haven't we? What else? 
feel like I'm getting good at this. Only one last step. Okay. As our guest, you may do the honor of lighting the candles. The lighter is in the school. I've got my own. Oh. <laughs> I never know when you'll need to light a candle. Right? You are a paragon of preparedness. Yeah, I guess Thanks. people grieve in different ways, don't they? Some people want to think... get rid of it. I, I don't know if I can Time do that myself. Light but... some candles and Oh, okay. Bless this back joint turn. finally. This is Amber we can go. back turned. Thank you, Sonia. I, she, like I said, she's my everything. I'm gonna get a tattoo of you, aren't I? Guys, what are we doing? Frankenstein's monster or Count Dracula? First to two wins. Yeah, I don't remember how long it took. Dracula, Dracula, we're going Dracula. Well, good. <laughs> I suck. Dinner will be ready in just a moment. Did you light the candles? Oh, okay, she's annoyed at me. Let's run away. Rachel and I both had great childhoods. Mine just ended a little before hers, I guess. The Amber family and fire. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, we're coming to the conclusion. Yeah, also Tatjani, you know, by the way, he's like, oh, Mr. Amber would like. I mean, maybe you would speak like that normally, I don't know. So, Chloe, are you and Rachel in any of the same classes? I wish. Rachel's all honors. I'm still trying to get into remedial... What's it called? Vocabulary. What about that fire? <laughs> <clears throat> Dinner's... Ah, oh, cool. You've got a tuxedo boy. I Thank love you, that. Rachel. The way the fire spread so it's fast. It's crazy. She was I so, like, on death's like doorstep. Like, the vets came to take her away. I'm going to say it's strange because we're playing Life is Strange. Uh, it's almost surreal. They say a fire like that. She took one look at the vets and was like, passion. not today. Passion? What does that mean? I don't know. You tell me. Because you're the DA, of course. Oh, bless me. It's certainly troubling. The latest report from the commissioner's office. What's his name? Suggests arson. Oh, arson. hey, Jack, mate. How Why you doing? Why would anyone do that? Right towards the back Any end of the game. Of reasons. With everything going on in the world today, even a town like Arcadia Bay isn't immune to the ills of society. Just to bring you up to speed, Jack, we had a chaotic playthrough. We nailed the play. We got all the lines right. Now we all took a line each. Jack it was pretty cool. Friends, I want you to know that our home is always open to you cool thanks oh uh, you can see rachel well about to snap i love the way it's she's the quiet one and she blows up troubled times as these that we remember what is most important to us family family's not merely a gift it is a responsibility as such those we love must be cared for and never ever taken for granted uh, guys, are we going to attack James here? Yeah, it, it's funny. It was live on the stream where I was like, voicemail Jack. And then, see? Guys, that's how efficient we are on this podcast. Like, Jack straight up read the article. We're good to go. Or, okay, one for attack, two for calm. Another one for back talk. We're at 2-2. Two, two. If I, uh, Jack's probably impartial. It looks like I'm going to have to flip a coin, guys. Uh, right. Attack his head, calm his tail. Uh, what was heads? Heads was attack, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. Well, it looks like we're doing a back talk, guys. 
Enough of this asshole. Rachel may have to take it, but I don't. I'm, I'm intrigued because I swear I didn't do this last time. At his own dinner table. Right, I'm gonna lock in again, guys. I'm not sure I agree, James. Oh? I thought you of all people would be grateful for family, at least. Okay, something to do with family. Gratitude seems like such a nice luxury. I can't say I've had the privilege to afford it. That is an excellent point, Chloe. We must always be sensitive to the way our privileges shape our perspectives. Well said, Mom. Still, there must be some room for personal responsibility. I'm sure you agree, Chloe. My dad was super responsible. He always drove under the speed limit. Then one day, a truck came along and turned him into a super responsible pancake. See? This is why it's so important I love how the to invite clock's diverse just going, voices like. <laughs> to converse with one another. It's absolutely stimulating. Hmm. Highly stimulating. Since you have answers for everything, Chloe, perhaps you'd like to enlighten us with some of your hard-earned wisdom about the world. Sure. I believe that we should look closely at everyone, especially the people in power, to see what secrets they're hiding. Very well articulated, Chloe. I am consistently impressed with how politically aware your generation is. Chloe is an excellent articulator. Excuse me, dear, but if this is what passes for politically aware these days, we're in serious trouble. James, that's unfair and also rude to Chloe. No, I don't believe it is. It seems clear that these points Chloe is what making think, are merely veiled attacks on me. Oh, well, that, we're, we're gonna go for that one. Are you suggesting that I'm using some sort of incognito mode where I can keep my activities hidden? Oh. That's crazy. Don't worry, Mr. Amber. I can tell that my progressive attitude is not welcome in this house. I'll see myself out. James, Chloe is right. You owe her an apology. I owe her no such thing. I believe she's willfully acting belligerently just as she did this morning. It is how people like her respond to adversity. People like her? So we're pro. I swear I'm hundred percent at what back eight to in the DA's office has taught you. I resent that. My office is committed to fair and equitable treatment. Yes, I've read the press releases. Excuse me? Are you calling me a hypocrite? Huh. <coughs> Rachel! I can't sit here and listen to this bullshit anymore. Rachel! Stop it, Dad! You're a hypocrite! Okay? I know! You lying, cheating, piece of shit, motherfucker. Excuse me? We saw you yesterday at the Overlook. James? Kissing that woman. James. Rachel, honey, whatever you saw or think you saw, I know it's hard, but I need you to trust me. No offense, Mr. Amber, but I think we trust our eyes more than you. That's enough. You are not welcome here or around my daughter any longer. I know exactly what kind of person you are from the moment I saw you. And I let my wife's compassion get the better of you. Oh? What kind of person is a that? A delinquent. A broken girl from a broken home. That's oh. enough, James. Well, I will not have you continue to speak to her like this. Does every episode end in Rachel, like, blowing up? I love the way that clock's still going the whole time. That's just a neat little touch. Why can't you just tell me the fucking truth? Stop lying! Stop being a politician for one fucking minute! Can't you just be my dad? Rachel, that woman you saw... That wasn't my mistress. That was your 
mother. Dun dun dun. Oh, I love this song, Daughter Youth. Such a classic. I love these little outros, man. Life is Strange does it so well. Shadows settle on the place that, that you left. left. A mind troubled by the emptiness. Destroyed yeah, yeah, no, I agree, Slashin. the finish line and if you're still breathing you're the lucky ones because most of us are heaving through that's the deck gone setting fire oh yeah for reference jack we decided to pay damon to save fun. drew and his leg names of the lovers that went wrong the that went wrong. Oh yeah, I don't know how I feel about the fact we refeed Victoria. Yeah, okay, I'm intrigued to see those reasons. See, we told her to give Nathan space. And I think it worked. I think we picked right. I don't think the option, like, the right option is for to get Samantha to, hunt, like, hound him. I'm the kind of person that wants space when I'm like, you know, oh, and it's the woman, Sarah. Yeah, that's true, Felicity, that's true. Oh, is the cutscene always the same? Oh, that's a shame. Oh, this music is just like bliss. Oh wonder. Lovely. Well, thank you for joining, guys. I, I will have you all know that there will be no stream next week because I have to do overtime at work. Uh, I'm working Friday night. So uh, there'll be no stream then. Um, so yeah, it will be the week afterwards because I, I can't really do any other day because Jack and I have to do some recordings and then I've got a bunch of other stuff happening. Yeah, I'll have to see you guys the week afterwards, I'm afraid. Here we go. So we we went along with Rachel's story at the start. In the minority there, uh, we refused to empty our pockets. Um, oh, yeah, because we had money in it, didn't we? You gave Damon the money. Oh, my God, are we in the minority in absolutely everything here? Guys, well, thank you. You made us pick a very interesting thing. And uh, we chose not to kiss Rachel. We chose... We asked her to get a tattoo, so yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that is true, guys. We have Wednesday for the FMV. So, like, you know, I won't be streaming on Friday, but we're going to be playing Late Shift with, you know, Jack on Twitch. So, you know, there'll be that instead. Maybe a little later than usual. Yeah, I mean, maybe I could push it. We'll see, Tatjana. Uh, right, let's... Next. So... We decided not to go to the play of the Elliot. We're in the minority there. Well, I don't know. The guy's a creep. I refuse to start over with David, as per our choices. Um, you didn't put the singing man on the dashboard of the truck. Oh, I missed that. You didn't pay off your debt to Frank. Well, no, because we wanted to keep the money. Uh, so we told Steph Rachel was single, as per your request as well. Only 15%. Uh, we didn't return Drew's money to him. 68. Wait, what? You didn't return... I thought we did. Oh, no. That's the door choice, isn't it? 
Uh, you didn't give Samantha advice. You told to give him space 22%. Oh, a lot of people actually didn't give advice there. You encouraged Victoria before the play. A minority again. Yeah, it's interesting. It, it, it's a bit... I mean, it ends in the roofy anyway, but... Oh, and that's an absolute split. Look at the split there, guys. Complete thirds there. Los Angeles. And then we attack James at dinner. We're in the minority for that one as well. Very interesting. Uh, let's go to the menu. Oh, no. Here's the next time. Shit. Shit. Episode menu. We're not going to play Hell is Empty just yet. And look at that. I love that. The menu is now a complete burnt crisp of a place and the forest is black. Most people said yes and don't talk again. That's why so many people did not burn the go. Sadly, we didn't see the Rachel single choice. You gave it to the meth dude. It was a great stream. Sorry I didn't talk much towards the end. I got a bit emotional. I'm okay though. Oh, really? Okay. Well, I hope you're okay. Feel free to talk to me if you want. You know, I... My chat room's always open in Discord. Um, love how she wears the outfit in the trailer when it's actually impossible. Oh, really? Is that so slashy? That's pretty interesting. And it is a nice menu screen. Oh, I just I can't get enough of that menu music. Anyway, uh, guys, I'm going to dash because it's been like just over two hours in the stream. But thank you very much. I hope you guys enjoyed me eating my chicken dinner. Um, I hope you enjoyed all the choices we made along the way. I hope you enjoyed Ruby's guest appearance, and I hope you enjoyed the sound of me pissing when I left my microphone on. So yeah, you are welcome. We do it all on the Butterfly Effect podcast. I can't lie, you guys get spoiled. Uh, we won't see you next Friday because I'm busy at work. However, I will see you Wednesday when we do the FMV with Jack. So thank you very much. We'll see you soon.